Hello everybody, I'm doing an update video and I'm in my van as you can see, I'm back in Canada. I just figured I gotta interrupt the program because it's been very slow, um, but it's also, I've got more Bali videos that come out, but I, I need to film something here soon uh, for a brand deal that's going to just, you know, it'll be obvious that I'm, that I'm back here anyway, so I figured I might as well start with this. It wasn't what I was planning on doing, but I gotta do this anyway, just to say hi. So, I've been back for five weeks. My visit in Bali was for two months, was the full length of time that I was there. I've probably got three more videos to share of that. It's sort of on the tail end of my visit over there, so there's uh, some diving stuff. There was, uh, I did do some other things while I was over there, but I didn't really film it. At this stage of my trip though, I was getting into a really difficult place emotionally, and I was just trying to understand a lot of the challenges that were coming up for me. It mostly had to do with seeing my daughter and not seeing my daughter, because there was three weeks in the two month visit that I was over there where I didn't see her. Like three weeks all in. So it was, uh, it was a challenge. and. Um, I was hoping that I could connect with her mom more on this visit and sift through some of the stuff of our past to try and uh, unpack and understand and at least start doing the healing process so that we can ultimately cultivate a better relationship with one another. But she wasn't ready to open up to that sort of stuff. So, uh, so that was a bit of a disappointment and then there was, you know, some, some challenges that played out, of course, one of them not, not seeing my daughter for three weeks was, uh, <clears throat> was actually a, a very difficult for me and I, I really didn't understand that one. Um, that really messed with my head for the last part of the trip and that shows in the videos that, that, that come out or at least in the filming style that I had after then. And so you'll kind of see that with the next Bali video a little bit, but um, you know, I tried to make the best of it and make light of the situation and go do a few things that I enjoyed doing, such as diving. There was a lot of other stuff to see on the island too. I did visit Volcano, went to a couple other places with some friends, but I didn't feel compelled to film or share some of that stuff. They were just heavily touristed. I wasn't in the right headspace for it. There was garbage in places where I thought there shouldn't have been garbage and that was a kind of a big distraction for me. Although as I'm giving you this update, I'm looking at a bunch of garbage that a vehicle just dumped off here last night. Anyway, the garbage thing happens everywhere. I just think in Canada, like there's a little bit more of a, a way to manage it than, than over there. Indonesia is just a group of islands in the middle of the Pacific Ocean and something needs to happen over there to, to help deal with it and I don't really know what that is but uh, I was certainly raking my my brain about what that could be while I was there and maybe that's in the cards for the future is to work with somebody else on that sort of thing and work on trying to clean things up I but I, I have no idea at this point so anyway um, the whole bit was difficult and it was it was a challenge not to be able to connect on the healing components that I wanted to with my ex-partner. However, yesterday I ended up having a conversation with her after being back here for five weeks, which is the first time we really had a, a deep conversation about all of that stuff. And so uh, that the process is starting to happen now, which is, uh, uh, which is great. I'm super grateful that that's going on and everything kind of goes in its right time so it's just the way the way it happens but uh, the videos are coming out slow you guys because I was in that funk and when I came back to Canada I was still in that funk I went up island I went to my cousin's cabin and I did a bunch of work up there to take my mind off of everything and just be around family and that sort of thing and then um, work through a lot of this stuff that I was working through and I was in no shape to really work on videos in the same capacity that I was before. Anyway, all this stuff is stacked up for me and it, that's kind of the stage of things and that's why things have been slow on the channel. Uh, and then there was a little bit of video stuff that I filmed here when I got back. I'll probably roll all this stuff out in time, but I figured I'd better interrupt the program and give you this update just because I'm going to be shooting a video for uh, a 
brand deal with EcoFlow, and that that's gonna, yeah, I, I gotta roll that out soon. They got a campaign coming up, and we agreed to, to do some work together. They're actually going in a pretty cool direction, and I've been thinking about that in the context of van life, and how sharing some of that stuff might help those of you in my audience that are here for that. So that that's that's what that's about. Anyway, uh, yeah, that, that's that's it. Um, I got that kind of just trying to take a pause here and think if there's anything else that I need to say, but I don't want to have a long gap here and just get... That's it. That's all I got. So, there's the update. Uh, some of you guys might see me on the road. I know some of you already have. I've said hi to a bunch of you, and I'm on Vancouver Island for the time being. For the time being. Yeah. Okay. Talk to you soon. See you later. Bye.